Hey guys, so in the last two tutorials, we created a Google Map application. So in the first tutorial, it was only focusing on a fixed location. And in the second part, we saw how to search our current location. And we also added a search bar and a button for searching so that we can search for any address on the map. And the camera is focusing on that address and also adding a marker there. So in this particular tutorial, we are going to see how to zoom in and zoom out. And we are also going to see how to change the map type. So open the activity maps.xml file. Here I'm going to add a button. I'm going to just make it smaller. And I'm going to add one more button here for the type. A small button. Go to the text tab and get that button inside the linear layout. So if you didn't see the previous part, then I'm going to put a link on the screen and also in the description bar below, you can check it out. Go to the design tab again. Click on the new button and for the text, write type. And for the ID, write B type. And for the on click value, write on or change type. I'm going to write change type. This uh, button will change the map type. I can actually write here for the text map type. Now Go to the maps activity.java, add a method called change type, public void change type. It should be exactly same as the on click value you added for the button. And here it will take an object of view class. Now we are going to first see if I'm just going to do uh, if the map is normal. And if you click on the type button, it will go to the satellite view. If it is satellite, then if you click on the type button, then it will be again normal. So first I'm going to check if mmap dot get map type equals Google map dot map type normal so i'm just checking if the map type is equal to normal so if the map type is equal to normal i'm going to change it to satellite right m map dot set map type and here write google map dot map type satellite else m map dot set map type so else means if the map type is not normal then it will be satellite so i'm going to change it back to normal so write google map dot map type normal now i'm going to run the application again and i'm going to show you how it looks so this is how it looks by default it is normal when you click on the map type button it will change to satellite and you, when you click again on the map type button, it will again change to normal. So this is the this is how you change the map type. Now we'll see how to zoom in and zoom out. So again go to activity maps.xml file. I'm going to add two buttons here for zoom in and zoom out. Again, I need to add a linear layout to make it look better because if I add buttons directly, then it will be like this so I'm going to add a linear layout and for the layout width write wrap content wrap for the height also wrap content and this linear layout remove it from here 
and add it after fragment. This is a little bit complicated then uh, I will add a link to my project so that you can check the whole thing out or get all files and if you have any error or doubt then you can just refer to the source code. So after the fragment I am going to add a button. So just add a button anywhere it doesn't matter and now actually it is added in the correct position now for the button text double click on the button and for the text write this and for the ID write B zoom in now you can see the button I just um, change the fragments width and now I'm going to add one more button small button here so now I'm going to add one more linear layout wrap content wrap content I'm going to change the orientation to vertical and inside this linear layout both the buttons will be there so for the second button double click on the new button write B and here write B zoom out and for, for both the buttons I'm going to make the on click value on zoom for both the buttons so after you add the zoom in and zoom out buttons and after you set the on click value as on zoom go to the max activity.java file and add a method on zoom so like public void on zoom and it will take an object of view class and here we need to check if the user is clicking on a zoom in button or zoom out button so like if view dot get id if the id matches with r dot id dot b zoom in then we are going to do this if view dot get id is equal to r dot id dot b zoom out then we'll do this so here write m map dot animate camera and it takes camera update so write camera update factory dot zoom in and similarly here m map dot animate camera camera update factory dot zoom out so this is how you zoom in and zoom out now I'm going to run this application so now the app is launched by default it is showing the fixed location now if you click on this button it will show your current location if you want to search for any particular address then you can just type it in the text field and click on the search button and it will show it will add a, mar it will add a marker there and it will focus the camera on that location and if you want to zoom in and zoom out then you can click use these two buttons if you want to change the map type from normal to satellite and back to normal from satellite then use that that button so this is how you basically create a map application ma google maps application this is not how you should design the ui i just wanted you guys to uh, know how to use these functions and i didn't want to waste my time desi uh, designing the ui if you want me to do a tutorial on material design or how to make a good ui 
that is user interface then leave a comment below or you can also mail me at techacademy8 at gmail.com if you have any doubts then you can email me so thank you for watching this video make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you like this video give it a big thumbs up bye